What up, y'all? It's your boy, Kev on stage. And you may not know this about me, but I'm addicted to chapstick. I've used it every single day for over 20 years. Can't go a day without it. But I'm tired of giving my money to the big Procter & Gamble's and Johnson's and Johnson's of the world. I'm gonna make my own and sell it to you and get rich. That's what I'm doing today. This is Kev on Chemistry. My lips are chapped even as we speak. Next time I apply chapstick, it'll be my own brand. I'm here at the lab in Southern California to meet a doctor of organic chemistry who's gonna make me a millionaire. Hello, doctor. Devana. Nice to meet you, Dr. Devana. Should I call you Dr. Devana? You can call me Dr. Dev. Dr. Dev? Yeah. Tell me about becoming a doctor in chemistry. Ooh, it's a long road. Mm -hmm. Long road. Let me so, tell you about my chemistry life. Uh, in 11th grade, I took chemistry. Cheated on every test. I got a C. That's how hard chemistry is. I did watch every episode of Breaking Bad, so I feel like I know a thing or two. Uh, we're gonna see. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna see today. So what's your business? Like, I know you're a doctor, but like, how are you making bread? Well, I make bread by making products. Okay. Products that we use every day. Mm. Things that make people happy, and just on a little level. If you go to Target, you go to Walmart, you like, hey, I like that product. I'm a, who made it? People like me. Really? Yeah. That is so fantastically dope. You're a black woman chemist. Hey. I, the first one I've met. Hey, hello. Tell me what we're gonna be doing today. Today we're gonna make it make chapstick. My lips look like Winterfell. <laughs> <laughs> well, we go we gonna make sure we, you know, make it better. Okay, I'm so excited about this. Okay. But before we get started, I need to get fresh like you. So hold that thought. I'm gonna right. come back with a fresh gear. All right. You back? Now we look like co-workers. Yeah, you got your oh. scuba glasses. Yeah, I'm goggles. the black Heisenberg. Uh, I am the one who not. Why you got on goggles? I don't know. They just said put these on. Okay. <laughs> okay. I do what I'm, I'm told. I'm gonna tell you why. Okay. It's called PPE. Can All you say right. that? PPE. Hey, yeah, you know me. <laughs> we grew up in the same era. I can you tell. Know, you know. What okay. does PPE stand for? Personal protective equipment. Got it. So what we're gonna get into first? I need okay. you to write some things down. Okay. I need you to help me out. Okay. So first thing. We're gonna weigh out some things. Okay. This is a hot plate. It ain't on right now, but we're gonna work with this. So you gotta this be is a hot careful. Plate? This is a hot plate. So if I turn this on, you can. Could you cook lunch on that, like a grilled cheese? Uh, you actually, I wouldn't, not in the lab setting. So before you weigh out anything, you looking at me? I'm before, taking notes, doctor. Before you work everything, you what? forgot, you forgot something already. I, it's my first day. <laughs> you forgot something already. What? Do you have on all your PPE? Gloves. All right, you ready? Ready. All right, so first, we're gonna heat this up. So I'll have you help me out on the first round. Okay. So we're gonna turn this to five. That's, what is this called? A hot plate. Hot plate, look at you, you remember things. Okay, mm -hmm. it's gonna get hot really quick. So we we'll okay. clear that. So the first thing we're gonna weigh out is our beeswax. So you just take your beeswax here. Okay. And we're gonna need six grams. Six grams of beeswax. Yep. Okay, we have 6.2. All right, Kev, I weighed out my beeswax, now you can weigh out yours. Another? 6.2 grams? Yes. This is starting to smell burned. Careful, careful, doctor. So mine's 6.18. Well, you got some on the scale, which we're not gonna use, so let's take that off. 6.14. All right, make Should sure you write that exact? down. No, no, I think it's good. It's like cooking, like it's a recipe, right? Yes, ma'am. Yes, doctor. How should I refer to you as to show you the respect you deserve? Dr. D. Dr. D, yes, Dr. D. 6.13. One three. It changed. Okay, 6.13 grams of beeswax. So now we're gonna weigh out, based on my instructions here, shea butter. Hey, so, where'd you get this recipe for lotion? Or it's, my, it's, it's my secret recipe. This is your secret recipe? Well, you're giving it to me. I'm gonna steal it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna patent it, cut you out of the deal, uh -huh. and by the time you sue me, I'll be rich. Okay, how you know it's not already patented? Ah, That's why I'm showing you. You got me there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you would sue me then. Let's just go into business together. That's what I thought we was doing when we came in well, here. I tried to cut you out. 7.1 grams, that's too much. I need to match my other thing, right? Yes. Okay, 6.13, so I just need a little bit more out. Shoot, now it's 6.9. I don't know how people make drugs. This is too much work. And this is only four, four or five ingredients. So think about wow. if you have to... Make crack? 
<laughs> That's what I'm saying. So the next thing we're gonna do, nine grams of almond nine oil. Nine grams olive oil. All right, so we're not gonna put it on this because almond oil is a liquid. Mm -hmm. We're gonna put it in. Solid liquid or, or gas. I learned that in chemistry. Which one is which? Water can be all three. In its solid state, it's ice. Liquid form of water as we know it. As it oh. evaporates in a gas. You read that before you came here on Google? Absolutely, a Wikipedia when I was in the bathroom. <laughs> All right, nine grams of olive oil. Okay. Almond oil. Okay, so we're not just gonna pour it because we want to be precise. Precise, right? So you can use a pipette. You know how to use one of these? Yes. You sure? It's just like a booger chaser. When your kids have that blue thing, you stick it in their nose, hold it, pull you're it right. out. Right, you're right. That's what we do as parents. You have kids? I don't. Great choice. <laughs> They're terrible till they're like 12. Then they can bring you Capri Suns and do the dishes. Yeah, you bring you the remote, do all that, right? But before that, all they do is, eh, we never have food to eat. You know what, what do you do in this family? <laughs> so how many? We, how much are we weighing out? Nine grams of olive oil. Of what? All men, oh, I got a lisp and a fat tongue. It's uh, tough. <laughs> Almond. Words beat me Almondy. up. Almondy. 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 Okay, okay so wait, I'm at 8.99. Uh oh, now it's 9.1. Zero one. No, that's fine. You sure? I promise. Okay. How many, how much am I supposed to be in here? You're supposed to be my tech. You're supposed uh, to be helping almond me out. Almond oil doctor is 6.0 grams. Nine grams. Nine grams. Uh, you know what, I can't really see that clearly. It's because these goggles are foggy. Let me switch out and get another pair of goggles and then I'll be a better assistant for you. I'll be a better you got, tech. You got some? Yeah, I just saw them back there. I don't know who they, who's there are, but they can't whoop me, so I'm gonna wear them. Okay, what am I, what am I going to again? 9.0 grams, Dr. D. Or a little bit over if you want to. If you want to. Okay, 9.05 is where you're at. 9.05 is yes, going to stop going? Yes. All right, so now what we're gonna do this hot plate is on. It okay. may be hot enough, I don't know. So we're gonna take one of these beakers. Okay. We're gonna pour all of your ingredients into this into beaker. It? Do mm -hmm. I pour it in before I lay it on the hot yes. plate? Yes, yes. Then you're gonna use, this is called a glass rod. Okay. So this is called a what? Beaker. And this is called? Glass rod. There you go. So now we're gonna pour everything in there. All right. Okay. Everything's in there. Oh, but wait, hold on. Don't don't rush into it. Okay, so you can mix it up. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, fuck it over. Let me see the fuck it over. All right, so now, slowly hover it over. My hand? No. Oh. <laughs> With the glass rod in it? Mm -hmm. It's not gonna break. Okay, now lay it, lay it down. Slowly, and now stir it. Why did I hover it over? So the temperature of the bottom can mm. become similar to the temperature. Here. Adjusting. Yes, because if it's too cold, it'll break easily. Really? Yeah, so if I took this off here and put it on this countertop, it would probably break. Dang, can we do that just to see what it looks like? No. Okay. So what's happening? Dang, it's coagulating. Um, is it? Disintegrating. They're meshing. It's melting. Melting. Oh, I thought it was like a chemical word. So now we're gonna put, while we're letting this go, I'm gonna turn this down. Okay. We're gonna add a fragrance, so you get to choose. Okay. All right, so I made you a fragrance. You okay. gotta just tell me if you like it or not. If okay. you don't like it, then you can make your own, whatever. All right. Okay. What is it? You gotta smell it. Mmm, peppermint. It's some little, pe little bit of peppermint, mm. little bit of grapefruit, little bit of citrus. I like food-based things, because if I'm hungry, I can just like nibble on my chapstick. Okay, don't eat this. I don't <laughs> eat a lot of it. I don't eat a lot of it, just like, oh, where's my Uber Eats? And just like, Okay, so much. you kind of like this? I love peppermint grapefruit oil. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> this is called black cherry. Okay. I like I like that. I ain't gonna hold you. You feel me. Oh man, that's good. This smells like clearly Canadian. <laughs> what is clearly Canadian? Remember that water back in the 90s? It was like, uh -oh. remember? <laughs> so remember good. That. Let's okay. go with clearly Canadian. Um, so we're gonna use this. Let's start with this one. Okay. Or do you want to use the black cherry? No, no, let's use that one, because I'm going to save the black cherry for my special something. All right, so you can put as much or as little. Fragrance? Fragrance. All right. Mm. So you want to put all that in there? No, nah, I'm going to just drop a little bit in there. So the thing about this is, this is only one batch. Normally, I make three different or maybe 20, 100 different recipes or prototypes to make sure we get the right one. This might not even be the right one. Hold on, now what? You make 100 different batches of maybe this? Maybe more. No way, for real? To make sure the ratios are right. I'm not in this to do it right, I'm in this to make money. So you gotta do it right in order okay. to make money because people ain't gonna buy your product no more. So what am I gonna put it in there and hope yes. it congeals? It will. 
So I hold it. Well, I'm not. I don't trust you. It's hot though. I don't. <laughs> Should I put it in one of these? No, no, no. You're gonna put it in one of these. My hands are shaking because I'm a little bit hungry. Okay, so don't bring it. Okay, no. Okay. I'm nervous. Okay, You're don't be nervous. close to me. Okay, so hold this. Don't burn me, please. I can't promise it. Okay, well, we're gonna leave it. Okay, like here this. we go. There you go. You wanna try a little bit more? This looks like candle wax. We're just gonna let it sit. I wanna hurry it up. So, we made our chapstick. Mm -hmm. Now, what normally happens after we make something, we gotta try it out, right? Yes. Like, does it work? Mm -hmm. Does it not work? How many prototypes mm -hmm. do we need to make? So, I'm gonna let you try your chapstick. Is that, is that, is that your chapstick? Oh, mm -hmm. this, one, this one's mine. Yeah. It smells amazing. Wow. Is that how you put on chapstick? How, how do you put it on? I'm just asking. This is a question. You think it was manly? <laughs> I put it on like this. How's it feel? It's it's smooth and light. A little lighter than, than I'm used to. I'd like a little bit heavier of a version. So would that be more beeswax? That could be one thing. So you want it, do you feel like it's moisturizing? Definitely feel like it's moisturizing. Just feels a little light to the touch. A little light. So you want more pressure? Yes. Okay. So what brings these two things together? What do you think brings those two ingredients together? And I made it easy because we only got three ingredients. Shea butter. <laughs> My mom used to get mad when she would ask me the question on homework and I wouldn't get it right. <laughs> beeswax. So, so Almond be oil. Be beeswax. Four ingredients, right? Glycerin. Well, we're not even using glycerin. I, just, I wanted to throw it out. So almond oil is soft. Shea butter is soft. What's the other ingredients that puts them together? Beeswax. Beeswax, right? Yes. And then the consistency is different, right? right? The consistency of the beeswax is different. Okay. So in order to make it harder, we're going to put more beeswax. That's what she said. Okay, perfect. That's going to make the perfect tube of chapstick. So you're only making one tube. No, no, no. I think we could do better. I think okay. you should make eight total. So we already made two. That's cool. Uh -huh. we, can, we can still put that in and mix it in. Okay. Let's make eight tubes of, of chapstick. chapstick. So I'll have 10 total. You'll have 10 total. Okay, so now I'm not supposed to help you no more. Don't help me. To, I'm just supposed to be sitting Don't back. Don't help me. God took my hairline and didn't let me grow a beard. I feel like, fam, but one he... or the other. <laughs> WrestleMania is expensive. I looked into it. I told my son it was sold out, but it wasn't. <laughs> it was just sold out for us. Hey, what if I did an accident and then I got superpowers right now? Because you know all the superpowers come in the science lab? And I'd be chapstick man, and I'd be like, boom. They'd be like, ah, oh, my lips are chapped. All right, here we go. We almost there. Is your head hot? Oh. <laughs> this is not so good. I don't know what people are gonna like that or not. <laughs> so you gotta hurry up because this could solidify in here. Okay, you don't want don't the want chapstick that. in here. Is this the safe way to clean? Absolutely not. Did you throw away your chapstick top? say I'm glad that I do this work. You don't want me in here making your chapstick, but you do because this is my show where I make stuff. <laughs> you need more? I'm gonna just, yeah, I'm gonna sell this. This is like I'm gonna sell this on the street. when God said you need vessel oil. Oh, come on in here. That's a message. <laughs> oh, when God yes. puts his hands on it. What you <laughs> thought made eight, made 12. Okay. Yes, it did. <laughs> Ew. See, when God got it on, see, this is anointing oil see, chapstick I see. now. Uh huh. I see. I see. You anoint your lips. Dr. D, this was tough. This was a lot of hard work, and we only used four chemicals. Think about if you have something like this, this chapstick I keep in my pocket. Mm -hmm. It uses what? Can Shoot. you count? You don't 20, count? 20, 30 chemicals. Including the ones you use in your chapstick. That's a lot. It's a lot. This is what I do every day. In your own business. My own business. Every I, day. I, I, I'm so impressed with your abilities. So what did you learn? So what I learned is safety, very A1. important. A1. A1. PPE, player protection eyewear. <laughs> um, <clears throat> all the safety stuff you were really big on. Oh, cross-contamination. It's a whole thing. What about the lab? Did I sound like that? 
I mean, in my head, absolutely. <laughs> but I think you're just using your regular voice. <laughs> but I really have learned to appreciate the precision that goes into what you do. And if you mess up, you have to actually do it over again. Yeah. And I was really impressed by everything you did. And that's why I have something special for you. For me? A gift for you. My I team like and it. I together, I like we it. put together a beautiful hey. gift for you. Thank you so much. This is the Kevon Everything hey. gift bag. If you want to open that up, take a look at your gloves for cross contamination. I don't need gloves. It's fine. You don't want to cross contaminate with your gloves. We got you some uh, some bedazzled safety goggles. Bling bling. Okay, so you look like Cardi B in a lab. <laughs> and you know that's my girl. <laughs> that's my girl. Well, when you get a chemical right, you be like, oh. <laughs> See, I can't. I can't do it. Okay. Dang! Look at that. Shout out to Natalie. She be doing all the cool stuff. We also got you your very own Kev on Everything lab coat. Yay. Okay, not to be sold. Not to be sold. This is one of one just for you. It's got the little buttons on the back for you. I appreciate okay. that. I'm gonna put this right That's here. Exciting. And I gotta put these on my head. We got you a brand new necklace that has serotonin in it, which is the key to what? Happiness. That's a chemical we all love. Thank you. Thank you so much. You want to just box those up and uh, mail them uh, to me? You detect. <sighs> okay. Do you well, remember? I'm going to just cap these off and take those. You going to take all these? Make sure you try one though first, right? We got to Oh, put it yeah. In that's a good idea. Smell it. Mm, mm. Yeah, we never got that smell <laughs> quite right. We never got the smell quite right. It is thicker though. <laughs> Did it not come off good? Too much beeswax. We should've went with eight grams. It's fine, I'ma sell it anyway. <laughs> so I gotta go. Okay, I got date night with my wife. Oh, hey, date night. I'ma kiss her with my own make custom sure you, chapstick. Make sure you give her one. A couple. Oh, I'ma give her one. I'ma say, babe, I made a this couple. for your lips. Okay, I'ma see you your piece of I made of this for your lips. Love you, goodbye. <laughs> Bye, Kev. Bye. Yes. Pretty girl sweat. <laughs> I love these. Let's see what they look like on. Fly. <laughs>